Welcome back everybody. I hope you're having a great day. Well, I know I am. So it's an exciting day for me. Today, well, yesterday, um, this GoPro 11 arrived in my mailbox. So I am quite excited to open it up, see what it is. Um, I have to say I am a big fan of GoPros, right? I've been a fan of GoPros for many years. Uh, I have quite a number of them um, and you know I've always been amazed how they performed um, how they worked and you know you take them just about anywhere with you they're relatively small don't put them in a bag anywhere and they, they just go they just go and they work they work extremely well well for me so far I haven't had a single one failed um, you know, I haven't had a single one destroyed and they've been, you know, through some drops, bumps, you know, incidents, etc. But they, they still all work. So, um, I'm not biased, I'm always open-minded as to the technology out there and everything, but I personally, as I say, I'm a big fan of GoPros and I'm very excited to get this one now. Uh, so in this video, we'll open it up, see what's inside. This is the uh, the extra bundle pack, right? So it should have extra battery and a few other bits and pieces in there. What I do want, want to see is obviously how the case is inside, right? Because I travel a lot and I always take, you know, GoPros. I'm always considered of space, you know, storage and, and especially the cases and how things affect what I did like and I have the uh, previous version I bought which is uh, 9 I skipped 10 purely because of the COVID I wasn't traveling so I, I didn't had any need for it right and there was from what I saw not too much improvement so but this is uh, 9 and it was also you know extra bundle package and if I open it right and I, if I'll show you right so what I like about it it, it has all these compartments in, inside the case right so it's actually quite easy to pack uh, you can put everything where it should be and uh, you know dump it in the bag and it's quite easy to travel with right so this is what I really liked about the previous one that I have so now let's see what this one has let's open it up see what's inside um, and uh, you know hopefully the case is, is good if you can hear um, if I shake it it's something is rattling inside so I'm not sure how sec secure stuff is inside but let's give it a try so we'll rip the box open I don't really need the case I mean no one keeps the cases some people say this box is nice well so just a just a box right so obviously if I look at this is 9 this is 11 they one to one they basically I would say the same right probably GoPro didn't invest into the designing new box but let's see so let's open it up and see what's inside okay so we have the, the paper which is clearly says your camera must be updated before you can use it and to update the camera it's relatively easy uh, if you've been using GoPros you know uh, you have an app on your phone or iPad or you know on the, or any other pad that you're using uh, you connect your camera um, and it will show that there is a firmware update and you just hit update and 10 minutes or so and the camera is updated and ready to go so make sure you do that uh, no one that's why there is probably a warning here uh, so yeah that's on the updating uh, I'm not gonna go through that one so let's get into the box see what's inside here um, so the standard uh, GoPro instructions and couple of stickers um, and we've got relatively thick instruction manual here so nothing special again if you've been using GoPros you know all, all this um, that's kind of come standard and yeah, the box is exactly the same as you can see. So the, the you know you have all the compartments, and if, you know if we compare it to 
our 11, our 9, so they literally identical. Right, so we'll close this one up. I don't want to use it anymore. For comparison, it's good, they're the same. So, what's inside the box? So, there is a head strap, right? Um, let's open it up. It's quite tightly locked. So, yes, I guess you put it like that and you connect the camera here. Good. I don't know if I'm gonna ever use it. I have a chest strap as well, which I really never used, but that's, I guess, nice to have. Probably will screw up your haircut, but, or hairstyle, especially as if you're a lady. Um, maybe over the baseball cap, that could be nice. So it has the, obviously the, on the water stick, floating stick. What I don't like about this ones is they don't open from the bottom. The previous versions are for like camera uh, six, seven, eight. Um, they they were similar, but they had a connector here, uh, a different connector, and they you were able to unscrew it, and there was space inside. You could put things like lighter matches, etc. So if you underwater, um, you could keep them dry. So that's a bit of a disappointment GoPro. I've noticed that in the last, since nine, you stopped doing it. Uh, holder, or connecting pin. Okay, what else we have here? Uh, we have a GoPro cable, charging cable, another of those pins. Um, you've got a uh, Stick a bit, not absolutely not sure what's the use of it. I guess you can uh, put it on your backpack or something. It's a bit, I don't know how strong that will actually hold. Um, you know, with the previous one, and I'll look at it. So the previous one had this one. So, and this one is actually quite uh, secure. I've used it a number of times and, and it's re relatively stable. Was now comparing to this one. Um, I guess it probably won't be as stable, so again a bit of a disappointment on the GoPro side. Um, another thing I've noticed, and I'll get to it shortly, but there is another thing. So you've got obviously a couple of adapters, which is fine. Um, you've got two batteries, so normal pack comes with one battery, so which is good extra battery is always good and you obviously have uh, let's pull it out have your camera all right so we'll open this one up and don't need this so the camera i mean the form factor of the camera is the same as 9 and 10 right so the batteries fit fit the all the cameras the same right and the and the connectors but the accessories also except for the media mode um, the rest of the connectors uh, you know even from the earlier versions will fit this one so nothing you know out of the ordinary that i can see on the camera right and if i pull the nine out so this is nine this is eleven can see they literally the same all the button positions uh, screens front back are the same and again on the screen it says you must update your camera before usage so make sure you do it okay what else and yeah that's about it um, another thing I do recommend if, if you are using GoPros uh, get the lens protector and one of those when you're traveling you just put it onto the lens and it keeps the lens safe so it doesn't get damaged in your bag or anything um, so this is something to think about one thing I've noticed right and I will see if I can show it to you uh, let me pull the camera out it's actually gone again a bit cheaper right which I, I don't like so if you can see this one here right it has this bit where the cable was right so it actually reduces the 
space all this stuff you can put inside so I'll probably will have to just you know cut it off right because it's clearly we'll just keep it open like that because yeah you need a bit more space because if you look at the previous one so this is the one from before it doesn't have that so you can put a bit more stuff into it straight away and the cable just goes at the top so no issues there well what can i say well first of all i have to say i am excited to get this one uh to get 11 um, i am excited to put it through its tests see how it performs um, i also recently got the iPhone 14 so I want to check uh, to compare iPhone 14 action camera mode uh, with this one so I think you know there are some advantages to each but we'll see after a uh, few tests that I run um, but overall look it's a great camera right I am excited to get it few recommendations if you are getting them get them with a spare battery um, they do run through batteries quite all, quite fast no matter you know what they say when you use it you'll realize uh, one battery is just not enough um, the second thing that I, I, I do highly recommend is I have this uh, charger um, you can get it for I don't know 10 15 bucks on GoPro website uh, so and you can charge two batteries at the same time uh, helps a lot uh, Otherwise, you have to, you know, put the battery into the camera, charge it, pull it out, put another one in, charge it, pull it out. So having a charger does help a lot. And uh, but otherwise, you know, outside, you know, the camera and couple of batteries, I would say, you know, there's not not too much in that pack. Um, I bought it mainly for the batteries, right? Everything else I, I probably don't even need. But the thing is, you know, and that this is what I've been thinking about. I think GoPro can also be a bit more creative and put a bit more, you know, exciting things into the packs. I mean, because the, the price-wise, it's not gonna alter much. Like, for example, how many people will, will use the head strap thing? probably not a lot but if they put the little tripod the GoPro tripod probably cost the same but at least people will use it and that's what I've noticed in a lot of those specs especially as uh, you know if you buy with GoPros with aftermarket uh, packs most of the things you won't use you you'll use one or two three maybe but the rest you probably won't but overall I am excited I am excited to have this camera. I'm excited, you know, to try the features. There's a couple of really cool features on this camera, especially, you know, uh, when you do the uh, stargazing and you can do the, uh, you can follow the stars. You, can, you know, it will record like a line following the star or the roads, you know, when you do, when you, you do videos and, uh, you know, like you see the tail lights, just lines. So. This camera apparently can do that. I will give it a try. I mean, I, I think I'm going into the mountains uh, in a couple of weeks and there's a lot of mountain and roads. So that should be exciting uh, to try it there. So yeah, overall, I think GoPro is always great camera. Uh, I'm sure it will perform well. And accessories, a bit disappointing, but it is what it is. We buy the camera, not not really the accessories. So that's it. If you like the video, give us a like, subscribe, and have a great day, guys, girls.